we're in a good place because we're here with uh, Roger Fisher, guitarist, and um, I don't know, spiritualist, mystical man, magic man, if you will, um, there to bring up something. Meditation. Do you do it? I'm so glad that you brought that up. <clears throat> Boy, in today's global climate, one wonders why is all this happening? And I believe that it's all happening because humanity needs a wake up call. We need to realize that we are interdependent. We need each other. We can't be divisive. We can't be at each other's throats. That's just not gonna work. So what could I bring to the picture that could be helpful to humanity? And what I came up with as an answer to that was music that is spiritually uplifting, which I try to put that in the, between the lines of everything that I do musically. And if you uh, are prone to reading books, there's one book that I think is just the absolute best book that you can read regarding meditation, and that's The Power of Now. So, Eckhart Tolle, The Power of Now. If you uh, if you're looking for a book to read, great book. And then I right after right after Bros though, get get Bros yeah. first. Yeah. <laughs> Pre-order Bros, which is available now. But then get The Power of Now. I love it. There's your plug right there. What do you think, Roger? Power of Now. Yeah. So uh, let me just give me a, just a couple of minutes to to fly something by you here. Okay, so I'm ready. Let's say you are somebody that's really stressed and you know bummed out about the pandemic or the racial tensions whatever here's a practice that i uh that i do and that i tell all my guitar students it this is mandatory for being able to get up on stage in a really high profile scary situation where you've got adrenaline going and you know like that this, right, right in that one of those situations. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. That's a great situation to be in, folks. It Look is. at that. Look at that situation. Everybody wants to be in that one. Roxy yeah. Guitar Army, take a snapshot of that. Let's go. Uh, okay. So, so what, how do you deal you do. with it? Here's what you do. You remember this practice by an acronym B A S H. B stands for breathing. So take a big deep breath. Hold it for ten, and then let it out slowly. Immediately, that feels good. You do that over and over and over for a while, and you feel really good. And what you're doing, you're slowing down your heart rate, which is really good if you've got a bunch of adrenaline pumping, pumping through your system. The A stands for awareness. While you're doing this and breathing deeply, you're putting your awareness into your toes, calves, knees, earlobes. You inhabit your whole body with your consciousness, the awareness of your consciousness throughout your whole body. Breathing deeply, total awareness in, in your body. The S stands for seeing. When you see, rather than think about this microphone and that tripod and that refrigerator and this green screen throughout the whole room <laughs> and these individual realize that all you're seeing is one image anywhere you look you're seeing one image and so see the whole image without concentrating it on any one thing more than another so breathing awareness in the body seeing everything as one image hearing the h stands for hearing and then you listen as if your life depends on it to everything you can hear and when you do that you realize oh i wasn't thinking just then because that is the enemy and we all we all almost everybody has that, that going works. all the time that's true and when you, when you can take that out of the equation Oh my God, there's no fear. There's no doubt. It's, it's peaceful. There's no anger. There's, there's nothing going on. It's just absolutely, you're just being, and that is the practice. And, and so I do that like 10, Gosh. 15 times a day, whenever I remember it. And yeah. it's, and then when you get good at practicing that you can go into a real, uh, a real demanding situation and just be, and just have it together like that. 
Right. Yeah, guy isn't all nervous and afraid and worrying about what people are thinking about him. <laughs> I, I, perhaps we have sort of a similar sort of credo. I, I mean, I I go with imagine your reality and enjoy the ride. Those are the two that I sort of go by. Um, just imagining your reality, don't you know? And and also um, practice persistence and patience, the three P's. So we're giving, you know, giving all our secrets away today, but they're not secrets. They should be shared with everybody. Um, I think another one that you possibly have is follow your bliss. Is that something that you? Oh yeah, definitely. But I want, I'm going to look up your system 12 guitar. Yeah. Method, thing. Yeah. That looks yeah. fascinating. Well, cool. I mean, as a, do you, have you taught, like you just said, you had a lot of students as well. And, and we have this thing called the Roxy Guitar Army that we build up and we're building it up with the with the System 12 Guitar Method. It is a non-traditional way of learning because I feel that uh, too many times with, with online lessons, uh, they miss the mark in one way, whether it's the quality of the video or whether they're not taking too much advantage, uh, enough advantage of the tech that's out there today or... They're taking too much of the tech and they're missing out on the mentor because you need a mentor, folks. I, I still feel. So what I think we've uh, sort of combined is old school mentoring and some really cool new age tech. So I think you and I have a lot in common because my oh, we do. My guitar program is called Beyond Guitar. Now, you can go online and learn all this theory, learn all this great stuff, and they can impart it a lot better than I can. But what nobody I see is doing is talking about your relation to sex and your guts and uh, your spirituality, you know? I mean, sex, sex is every plant and animal <laughs> and insect and fish on the planet is having sex and it's a real important part of our lives. And get you into trouble though sometimes from time oh to time it'll get you into trouble, huh? Get you yeah. get you into trouble with rock and roll bands, apparently, too, as well. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Roger. <laughs> but uh, you know, you bring these other things to the table and it's beyond guitar, especially spirituality. Yeah. Because you know, uh, as we get closer and closer to self-annihilation, <laughs> we yeah. need to we need to evolve. Peace, yeah. love, and Armageddon. That's another one of the album titles. It's like, what the hell's going on? <laughs> Hello, folks. Roxy here. Thanks for watching the video. And if you liked it, hit the subscribe button or one of the videos around me to watch more. If you'd like to, please leave a comment. If you didn't like the video, maybe you'll forget how to type. Thanks. Yeah.